I got three of the most influential mixtapes of all time. What up, y'all? It's The Bridge with Kyle Santillian, where we connect all things hip-hop, especially that classic hip-hop. And today we're talking mixtapes. I'm going to bring it in at number one. DJ Doo-Wop. The mixtape was 95 Live. In the house, say what now? Yo, Doo-Wop representing Boogie Dance. Why was this mixtape so influential? Well, Doo-Wop was one of the first DJs to introduce having rappers spit exclusive freestyles on his mixtape. He would take the first 15 to 20 minutes, and it'd be all your favorite rappers spitting bars on his mixtape that you may not have heard on the album. Yo, Google it, check it out, 95 Live. Number two, 50 Cent is the future. You can hum all you want to, come all you want to, but I ain't gonna want you if nobody wants 50 Cent came in and changed the game on mixtapes. It went from DJs putting your favorite songs on mixtapes to artists remixing songs that you know and giving you a new version of that song in the way that they wanted to do it. 50 Cent kicked that thing off. If you don't believe me, go back and check out 50 Cent is the Future and everything else that he dropped back in 2002. And last but not least, everybody knows this guy came through and murdered the mixtape game. I'm talking about Lil Wayne, my favorite, Dedication one, Gangsta Grills. Wayne came through and bodied it. Gangsta Grizzly! You won't be out in the streets, mouth full of blood. And we're talking about a time period where people in the South knew how nice Lil Wayne was, but I think that mixtape got Lil Wayne respect as an MC across the board, all right? Three very influential mixtapes, Doo-Wop 95 Live, 50 Cent, 50 Cent is the Future, and Lil Wayne Gangsta Grills Dedication 1. If I miss one, let me know what it is in the comments, all right? Kyle Santilli in the bridge. You know how we do it, baby. Connecting all things hip-hop.